Welcome to Igor Tech Channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable or disable the libraries folder in Windows 10. Libraries are virtual containers for users' content. A library can contain files and folders stored on the local computer or in a remote storage location. In Windows Explorer, users interact with libraries in ways similar to how they would interact with other folders. By default, libraries are not displayed in later versions of Windows 10, so they'll need to be reactivated for them to appear, and the process is remarkably simple. To enable or disable the libraries folder, follow these steps. Start by pressing the Windows key and R, then enter Control Folders. Hit Enter, or click the OK button and the File Explorer Options window will pop up. The options available in here can drastically alter the way Windows Explorer works, so be careful what you enable or disable. Head to the View tab, and scroll down to the bottom of the Advanced Settings section. At the bottom of the Advanced Settings section, you'll notice a box labeled Show Libraries. Click the box to tick, and re-enable the option. When you've done that, click the Apply button to activate the change and you'll see that the libraries are now available via File Explorer. You can now close the File Explorer Options pop-up window. The libraries are by default, set up as area-specific shortcuts. You can right-click each library entry, select properties from the menu, and create new library locations, change the icon and much more. Going back in the File Explorer option, Restore Defaults will return the library to its original setup. This covers how to enable or disable the libraries folder. If you have a question to ask, leave it in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer it. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.